Hello, everybody. Hi. 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 <laughs> I was a little bit nervous. I've had a few drinks now. <laughs> now I can't read it. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, why are you laughing? <laughs> Come on. Thank <laughs> Right, so before we start, have we all got drinks to toast? We have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. right. Um, firstly, on behalf of my ex girlfriend and I. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that had a worry. We thank you all very much for being here today and sharing Sorry, our special Danny, day. Don't don't you <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to be quiet. <laughs> You're not going to sing, are you? No. <laughs> um, so I, I can honestly say it, it wouldn't have been the same day without you all here today. Although a lot cheaper. But... <laughs> no? <laughs> but no, seriously, most of you have travelled a long way to be here today and that means a lot to us, so thank you very much. Um, we did a candle earlier. Um, unfortunately, it's not been possible to have everyone we love here with us today, um, but obviously are with us in our hearts and thoughts, so with them in mind, would you please stand and raise a toast to have some family and friends. Cheers. 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 <laughs> So I want to say firstly thank you to my parents. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't be standing here right now. <laughs> um, no, they, they've always been there for me. Um, and I'm very fortunate and proud to have you as mum and dad, so thank you. Um, so to mum and dad. <laughs> mum and dad. Uh, I also want to say thank you to my new mother-in-law uh, for all your help in preparation for today, running around and sorting and organising things over here when we couldn't, um, especially the table decorations, which you all have to agree are brilliant. Um, so thanks, Jean. Close to Jean. Uh, thank you also to Jamie for being my best man. It's fair to say we've known each other a long time, uh, nearly 31 years. We, no, we were always close growing up, always together, causing mischief, and so really there was nobody else that would fit that position any better. Um, so thank you, Jamie. Also, a uh, big thank you to Jamie and Phil. Um, Phil. Oh, <laughs> for organising um, the SAGDU. Uh, what a great weekend and a weekend that I will never forget. Um, I actually say this more literally than most of you think. Um, and I actually have a bit of confession to make. Um, so I'll tell you the story. So, whilst on the stag, after several beers and en route to the next pub, we come across two tattoo studios that were actually next to each other. After some whispering behind my back, the guy said, Chris, we'll make this your decision. You can either go into this one on your own, which is the first one, and choose a tattoo of your choice. or..." You can go into this one, along with all of us, and we choose the tattoo for you. Now, obviously, I wasn't having any of it and laughed it off. Soon realising they weren't joking. Um, I therefore picked the most sensible option and went in the first one on my own to choose the smallest, most discreet tattoo I could find. After flicking back and forth through the tattoo catalogue, there was only one that really stood out which I now have on me. <laughs> so I guess you want to see it, yeah? Yeah. Right. No, I'm only joking. Um, so 
some of y'all. No way. Look at Kay's face. He's not allowed. He's not allowed. said he's not allowed. So, you need this. <laughs> <laughs> so the, this does appeal it, it was the most fitting one because uh, as a kid I loved them and I now have three as pets so um, it's <laughs> Michelangelo <laughs> Teenage Mutant Hero Tales transfer is that real? I actually no, feel no, relieved. No. I don't have to keep wearing long sleeve shirts and stuff. Oh, really in up. bed as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but um, th <laughs> thanks to the lads who made the effort to come along to the stag do and making it the weekend it was. I think we all had a great time. Um, and of course now for the bridesmaids. Uh, you all look absolutely amazing. Uh, thank you all so much for helping organise uh, such a perfect wedding uh, and also a special thanks to the maid of honour, Judy, for all the help she has given Anna. You definitely saved me a few jobs, I think. <laughs> um, and also everything you did for organising the Hindu, which was enjoyed by all. So uh, to the bridesmaids, if you wouldn't mind the toast. Um, we would also like to thank you all for the cards and gifts um, and a special thanks to those who have given checks and cash for the uh, tattoo removal. <laughs> and uh, uh, finally, uh, to my wife, Anna. She, she is beautiful, intelligent, funny. <laughs> Carry, carry, carry. Okay, I could go Harry's on, but I'm struggling to read her handwriting. <laughs> <laughs> In all seriousness, I think you would all agree she looks absolutely stunning. There are. Thank you. There are so many good times and moments that we have enjoyed together. Um, days out, holidays, nights out, having our little girl, etc. And I love that we can continue to do this for the rest of our lives. They say you don't marry someone you can live with, you marry the person you can't live without, and I think that sums up us perfectly. So be, please be upstanding for the most important toast of the day to my wife, Anna. So now onto the poem. I'm uh, That's it for me. Um, now before I pass you over to the best man, I need to tell you that. Any stories you might now hear about me that obviously stand, sound out of character, which you probably will, um, are about as fake as this tattoo on my arm. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, all. And Jamie. Yeah. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. I'm Jamie, Chris's Hi, Jamie. brother. Uh, I would first like to congratulate Chris and Anna. Thank you. Thank you. Anna, you look beautiful. Thank and so do all the bridesmaids. <laughs> um, growing up with Chris was always very entertaining. Um, that's very tame. Up to something, like the time he was about nine or ten, he kept turning the main power supply off to the house. 
um, and make your mum and dad throw the uh, electricity board to come out and fix it. <laughs> Chris did always look after me and Joanna, being the eldest. He came out and helped me many times, uh, many occasions, like when I was far too drunk. He definitely showed me the way. Um, that was the working hard pays off, and I was lucky having Chris to look up to, even if he does take longer than Anna to get ready to go out. <laughs> He will make a great husband, and he already is a great dad. But after 30 years of knowing Chris, I never realised what a great singer he is. Oh. <laughs> he cleared a dance floor in Benidorm, so... <laughs> <laughs> um, True story. Uh, there was a lot of things I was going to write tonight, um, oh. for today. But, um, to be honest, they were... I couldn't really say much. Um, can we all place, uh, please raise a glass to the new Mr. and Mrs. Mrs. Newman, please? Mr. for breakfast on our way home from the hour now. And in the car on the way here, I was asking her questions about, do you remember, do you know where we're going? She said, you know, when I lived here, I think I was permanently drunk. (laughs) 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 Which is probably right. (laughs) Um, So we've had a lot of good memories. Uh, Anna is, um, she's headstrong. She's um, insistent, tenacious, persistent, and she's <laughs> and she'll fight for justice. So if you if you've got anything you think is wrong, or you need sorting out, an energy person like the time when she sorted Johnny's bed bugs out. Oh. <laughs> oh, <yeah>. Brilliant. <laughs> Come on, Johnny. Um, She's also loving and loyal, and um, and she loves her family. Um, we've had great memories as a family, and Anna and Chris and, and the gorgeous Lulu have now got their own memories to make, and I hope that I have many years seeing those memories develop. Um, I, I'm not one to offer relationship advice, obviously. <laughs> but what I do know is that 
you have to communicate. So it doesn't matter how you do that, but you have to do it. So whether you're shouting, Anna, or crying, or however you do it, you have to communicate. And uh, never be quiet, never let things fester. So make sure that you talk to each other. Be best friends, always. I love you both. And can I ask you all to stand and raise a toast to Anna and Chris. Anna and Chris. Anna and Chris. Anna and Chris. Anna and Chris.